is we call the split line. Okay, it's the split line. So in this situation here, as soon as we make the pass, just stop right there, that's one on one. So the minute you catch that, you have to think one on one. And that's what we did with our rip throughs. So as soon as you catch it, if I come out and it's open, you rip, get on the rim, that's offense. That's one on one. That's one on one right there. Okay, so take it back. Let's get another player just here. Another player here. And, and uh, we'll get uh, a low post player. Okay, so right now, as soon as you catch it, it's one on one. If you don't have anything there, which is fine, we now are playing two on two. Two on two. Right, so this is two on two or the two man game. Okay, so what we do, I talk about spacing. So just say we start the ball on this side here. Okay, so right now, this would be three on three. We can do lots of different things on this side of the court. So that's three on three. This is two on two. So as soon as we make the pass, just so you pass this here, what we want to do is create spacing. We want to open up the key as much as we can. So what I get my players to do, just say you pass it there, let's get out of the way. So you go to the corner, you go to the wing, and you lift to this spot here. So now what we've done is we've opened up the whole key. Okay, so what we've done is we're being unselfish, we've passed the ball here, we're playing two on two. The aim of offence is to play to your strengths. Do what you're good at doing. If you're a driver, drive. If you're a shooter, shoot. If you're a screener, screen. If you're a rebounder, rebound. Play your natural game. Play to your strengths. Okay? And what we want to do is, as you get older, add things to your strength. Become a good pull-up jump shooter. Become a good three-point shooter. So you can play multiple positions. So right now, we want to put people in positions for them to maximise your strength. Okay, so right now, we're going to start off with what we call breaking down the two-man game. So the alignment will always be a two guard front. So for spacing, so just into here, you can be in that spot there and you're out of the corner. So just say if you go back to the low post, okay, you can come back. Okay, so this might be the alignment. So it could be a transition set. Okay, so just say the ball's down here. So this is what I call the one man. That's the three, that's the four, that's the five, that's the two. All right, so I also teach by a numbered system, a numbered system. So your one's your point guard, your three runs the left lane, uh, the two runs the, the right lane, the four man's ahead of the ball, and that's the trailing big. So just say we swap sides here. So right now, it doesn't matter which way we really go. So if the ball comes this way, this, no, no, you stay there. This is our two-man game. All right, so we're just gonna break down some different things. So you just come back this side. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna look at doing, very, very, very simple stuff, so the ball's there. So as soon as you make the pass, face it. So you go to the corner, you come out, you lift. Okay, so what these people are doing, they're being unselfish by getting out of the way to allow you to play. So I might say, so I know you're a great penetrator, so we want to put him in a position to penetrate. So right now you guys get out of the way, okay? So right now we make the pass. So the first thing, one on one, rip, make your move. If there's help defense, now we can make the, the extra pass and you know, kick, kick type of thing and being unselfish with what we do. Okay, just take it back. If this person, make the pass, you rip, you're always going to feel behind. So he's your, what we call the bailout player. So you're thinking layup, you're thinking pass or pass. 
Okay, and right now that could be an extra pass here. And you might stop because it's helped defense, turn, and there's our shot right there. So you guys are playing two on two together. Okay, so let's just take it back. So the first thing we're gonna work on, very, very, very simple stuff, is just pass and cut. Pass and cut. So right now, so say the ball starts here, always like the ball to get reversed. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Okay, so we, we kick it, kick, kick. Okay, so right now, what's your strength? Post player? Can you post up? You can post me up. All right, so he might cut and post me up. Okay, so right now, throw it in. Okay, make a move, bang, play out of that. So with your individual skill development, you've got to learn to play in the post. Okay, so right now, are you a, a post player, shooter? Shooter, okay, so you're a shooter. This is what I like to run for, for this person to be a shooter, make the pass, rip through, go, rip, feel behind, stop, there's a shot. So that's, that's what we can do in a two man game for a shooter, just as an example. All right, so what we're gonna do is just start, let's, uh, we won't work that side. Let's get an, another line just over here, another guy over here. So we'll get a, another basketball over here. Okay. All right, so the ball's, yep, so we start out here. So first thing we're gonna work on for our two man game is rip through, fill behind, shoot it. Okay, let's, let's get another ball over here. Let's get the, another group of three and shoot it. Okay, go, rip, rip it. Here we go, throw the ball there and shoot it. And go, go. So kick, rip, come in, pass and shoot. Good, and go straight into it, rip, and shoot. Good, so this is for a shooter. This is a two man game for shooter. Go. Yeah, keep it on. Rip. Good. Good. Here we go. Good. Okay, so now, if you're not a shooter, don't shoot it. So don't shoot it. So right now, I don't know what your strengths are, but you should know if you can't shoot the three, don't shoot the three. Make it a one bounce jump shot. Get in closer. Or you might penetrate a second time. Okay, so you guys work it out. If you're not a shooter, don't shoot it. Grab it, put it to the floor, maybe make a runner float or whatever. Okay, go. Rip. Good, here we go, straight into it. So play to your strength out here. Good. Get to a spot that you feel comfortable with. Good, good. Okay, next one. So this is the point where we talk about individual skill development. You've got to work on your moves out here. So you rip through moves, you get layups, loadings, whatever it might be. You can throw behind, shoot it, shoot it. If you're not, don't shoot it. Okay, keep the very simple. Okay, now, you're a post player. You are, okay? So he's a post player now, so you're gonna go post up. Go, kick, sit, tap, post up, make a move, go. Here we go, next one. Cut, make a move, good, here we go. Okay. Yeah, so go in the post, and hold it right there. So right now, even though you're not a post player, so guards match up on guards, wings on wings, bigs on bigs. Okay, so right now, if, if you're a guard, you can still post up. You just got to learn those skills. Okay, so just because you're not big doesn't mean that you don't have to post up. Okay, here we go. So we take it inside. Good. Okay. Just say there is a mismatch. What you can do is pass it. So pass and cut. If I'm bigger and stronger than you, what you may do is take out to what we call the short corner. So just there. So now you big, you get a bigger player having to come out and spend. So now what can you do? Rip it. Either way. So beat me. If you can you better beat me. Go. I told you intimidating. You scared. 
instead of the big fat guy. Okay, so right now, you can post up in the post, you can post up in the short corner. So you're playing to your strength out there. Okay, go, real quick. Good, so we just make a move. Just put you know, individual skill development, yeah, bring them out. So take them off the dribble, nice shot, good. Good, so we mix it up. Okay, hold it right there. The next thing we can, we can build here in the two-man game is pick and roll. Pick and roll. Okay, so ball starts up here. So we make the pass to the wing. You've got to pick your man up. So the first thing you do, like you did this morning, is bring it down, cross here. So, yeah, you might be yeah, can dribble there, keep the line back. Come and shoot. So cross the over, bang, hit me, and shoot it. So as soon as I catch it, I catch it here, I set my man up, I wait for the screen, I'm coming off, I'm probing, I'm probing. I'm, but right now, let's come off and score. Okay, here we go. So now this is just pick and roll, it's a two-man game. On ball screen, set, come off. Good, and shoot it, go. Good, here we go. Good. Nice. Here we go. Couple more. We set it up. Good. And hold it right there. Okay, so from this, so we're playing two on two. These plays, you're getting out of the way, allowing you to play. So I call this screen and re-screen. Screen and re-screen. So right now, drive it to the baseline. So, sorry, um, yeah, come off it. Come off it, there, turn, restream, go, go that way. Okay, so now we're starting to play two men go. So this is stream and restream. Go. Okay, so set it up. So come off, there, and then come back, go. Get on the rim, so we're working different angles. Here we go. Yep, so right now you can pass to your, your teammate. Good, so now we're hitting the guy who's diving to the rim. Restream. Good, make the layup. Reset. Good. Good, so these plays, you're playing two on two. Good, and hold it right there, nice shot. So there are things you can do out on the wing. Next thing, if you're, just say you're a shooter. You shooter? Okay. So right now we're going to what we call pick and pop. Pick and pop. So we kick it on, set it, come off. He's a shooter. So right now come off it and pop go to the corner. So now we've got the shot out here. All right. So this is called pick and pop. Pick and pop. Here we go. Straight into it. Come off. There. We pop and we shoot it. Good. Good. There you go, you are a shooter. Bit like Coach Alex. Oh, you're popping, you're popping. Yeah, <laughs> great move. We go pop and shoot it. Good. Come off. Good. And okay. So now you, you, you're not a shooter. So you're going to dive hard. Okay, you're going to dive hard. So spoon and roll, straight line to the rim. Go, come off it, go hard, dive hard, and we make the pass. Good, here we go. Set it, dive hard. Good, nice shot. Here we go. Come off. Good. Nice. And hold it right there. Okay, so our two-man game, you can screen and re-screen. You can pop to the corner. If you're not a three-point shooter, maybe just go to the short corner. Or you can dive to the basket. So you've got three different things you can do just off the screen and roll. Okay, just say there's a mismatch. Okay, there's a mismatch here. So now, okay, because you're a really good post play, I've got four fouls. I'm in foul trouble. So you can dribble entry, dribble it hard, come, post me up. Post up, get inside, make a move, make a move. 
Foul, I'm out of the game. Okay? All right, so this time we identify foul trouble, mismatch, dribble hard. Go. Good, throw it in, make a move. Good, you get their, bit, get their player out of the game. But you could be in the bonus. You're in the bonus here. Good, here we go. Good. Okay, hold it right there. So remember this morning when I, I was talking about our passing, you know, how we're passing around our body? This is what it's all about now. Okay, go dribble entry, go post up. So right now, you've got to, you've got to make good passes. So that's why we practice with our passing outside hand. Okay, so that's what we call a two-man game. You can do lots of things out of that. And what I want to do in every training session is play two on two from these spots. So this is part of our half-court offense. And you guys get to know what your threats and weaknesses are. So you guys got to communicate with each other. Or you know you're a shooter. We know he's a shooter, so hit. All right, so you're a shooter, so what can you do? You can pop. Get play to your spread just so you might rip it. You can rip and throw behind. Okay, so put yourself in a position that you're good at. Okay, so that's what we call breaking down the two-man game. Now let's get uh, a, a low post over here. Yep, here and here. Okay, so just, just yeah, fill, fill these spots here. Okay, so right now we're coming down the court. So to start off with, okay, so right right now we, we can play straight into two-man game. Okay, so you kick. That's the two-man game you guys are playing. So what do you guys do? You've got a space. Oh, hold it one sec. Hold it one sec. Let's actually start the ball just here. Okay, back up a bit. Okay, so we've got our lead post. We've got this player. We're coming down the court. So I might say we're playing two sides. We're coming down, we're playing two sides. So all I'm saying is that you guys are playing two on two. You guys get out of the way. Go. Kick, space it, out, lift. Okay, so now you guys are playing. Let's go screen and roll. Okay, come off it and stop right there. Okay, so you're going to dive this time. Okay, so just, just to help me out, you're going to dive. When you come off, you're going to make the pass. Get on that cone, right in there. You know, further away, about there. This person, again, depending on what your strength is. You're a shooter, get on the three point line. If you can't shoot the three, come on in, just to there. So you get to a spot where you can shoot it. So throw, so come off. So you guys are playing, but right now you're gonna fire the pass there. Now you keep going, we go high low. Hello. High low. Go. Kick. Layer. Okay. So it's a two-man game, but we're going to hit this player up here, and we go on high low. Okay. Let's have a look at that. So let's start the ball here. So we're starting to add things together. And go. So kick. Kick. Lift. Kick. Screen and roll. Come off. Kick. Throw it in. Good. Make it. Here we go. Next group. Next group. Here we go. So two, two side, high low, two side, high low, go, kick, space it, come off, kick, high low, good. Now the pass I like is what I call a shot pass, shoot it. Instead of trying to thread the needle through here with a bounce pass, as soon as I catch it, so I'm coming up the lane, okay, go, I'm coming up the lane, here so I'm getting my hands ready I want to shoot it I want to shoot that to the player into that gap okay so catch it and, sh and throw it into set and go let's run that again next group keep rotating spots guys so still we're going two side high low go yep you're our passer so this is this is the terminology this is like a point forward. You might have heard that terminology, point forward. You're a passer, okay? You're a shooter and a passer, okay? Go. Kick, space, 
List says we're opening the figure. Good. We finished off. Nice. Here we go. Next group. Here we go. So it's an isolation for, for this person diving. Go. So kick, lift, face it, come off. And stop right there. Stop, 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 stop. The ball's there. Good catch, but I'm here. Post up. Stop. Doesn't matter. So you'll hold it there. Throw it to that person. Now roll it in. Go. Make a move. So that's why you've got to see the floor, see what's going on. So when I catch it, if you're open, I'm throwing it to you. If I can't, I'm throwing it to that player and you throw it in. Okay? I, I call this with my team power. Go. A kick. Kick it on. Lift. Come off. It's denied. Reverse it. Roll it in. Good. Good. Here we go. Next three. Kick. Go get him. Good screen. There. Space it. Space it. So what we want to do is, is, is catch the ball right in here in this semicircle, right in the charge circle. So you've cut, I'm playing here, I've stopped it, there, roll it in, drop step, go, foul. Okay, so this is a, a physical contest right in here, okay? One more time. Okay, one more time, here we go. Kick. Kick, come off, dive hard, have a look at it, kick, good, okay. So, right now, you guys play one on one, two on two, when the ball comes back, just stop. Go, here we go, so come down, remove the ball, kick, kick, come off, pass, and stop right there. Okay, so, this part of the offense, so just say you're, you're a three-point shooter. I like, I like to catch a few from space. You guys have had your turn, okay? You can't score because there's good defense out there. Okay, fantastic. So right now we've explored, we've come down, we've moved the ball, you've looked to throw it in. It's not there. So this is now you're the point forward. Nothing's there. So now it's our turn to play three on three. So you guys want to space it. So where can you go? Yep, get out to that cone. Lift up to here. So now what I've done is you guys have had your turn. It's now my turn to play. We're playing three on three right now. There's lots of things we can do. So right now the first thing is just simple screen and roll. Okay, pass. Come off it, set the screen, and dive hard. Right in the gear. Yep, so we're having a look at this here. Hit him on that. Now, when it's three side action, it's hard to pop. Why? There's a guy in the corner. Okay, so the three side action, yes, you can pop, but it creates a lot of congestion. You're probably not going to get a great shot. So you have to have the discipline. You're going to dive as hard as you can. You're coming off this here, and you're going to roll it straight inside. You're going to make the play, okay? So what we're going to do now, just so you start to, to build up our offense. Uh, so it's all right. go by post. So we reset it. So one man, three. So we're going to come down a couple of dribbles, reverse, two side action, screen and roll, come off it, come straight off it, and make the pass. Kick, now you guys space it. Lift, dive. Three man game, dive, dive hard, throw it in. Okay, next group, here we go. Kick, kick, create space. Kick, on ball, dive hard. Good, very good. Here we go, next group. Let's get a few reps in here guys. So this is three man game where we're just diving to the rim. And go. Kick it on, kick, come off, straight away, pop the tail, dive it hard, good. Here we go, so bring it down, let the ball move, move the ball, let it flow, kick it on, kick, kick, come off, good. 
right shot. Next one. Come off, throw back. Rip. Good, good. Okay, here we go. Kick it on, kick, come off. Throw back. Good, nice shot. Okay, next one. Throw in the post. All right, so we're in throwback, so I catch it and I roll it in, make a move. Here we go. Kick it on, move it, space it, open up the key. Kick, kick. Good, roll it in, make a move. Nice, good. Here we go, next group. Let's pick up the pace now, boys. Let's be sharp now. Good, throw it in, good, make a move. So these are different ways of looking to isolate people in the post. Here we go, one more time. Kick, kick, come off. Good, throw it in, throw it in. Nice, good. Okay, one more. One more. Go. When I blow the whistle, stop. Go, go. And stop right there. Ball's there. Okay, so right now, in this situation, I fronted. I fronted the post. So what can you do? Throw it throw back? Yep, high low. High low. Okay? So right now, if, if you're open, you give it to me. But it's not, I've got them. Don't force it. We look high low. Seal the man. You might even throw it to that person. Okay, so you can, so when you catch it, your first look, oh, he's open, or I'm not open, throw, throw it to here, skip, we're looking. Okay, just say it's not on. So you've got the ball. Okay, so right now we've come back. Now what are we in? Two man game. So you've got to understand, the game of basketball, it's a team game, it's not about you. So we start off one on one, Two on two. Ball's been reversed. Go, so kick it. Oh, sorry, you're in the corner. You spaced it, you lift. So we're open the key up. So now it's three on three. If you can't score off it, it's okay because there's good defensive teams there. So now we throw it back. It's your turn now. So it's your turn. My turn. Your turn. This is where the passing of the ball helps you with your offense. Let's go back to our three side. The next one I want to look at is we have a shooter in the corner. So go, kick it on, kick, kick it on, kick, come off it, and stop right there. So now, get right in that corner, he's a shooter. That's Steph Curry, right there. Okay, so right now, you're going to come off this here, we're going to go straight. So I'm, I'm, I'm playing this guy hard. Come and set it up, set it up, come off, bang. Give it to him, and you roll. Okay, so now, three side, where we're screening for the shooter in the corner. And after I screen it, you're going to rip. Here we go. So three side with the screen. So come off, kick, come off, head hunt, head hunt. Good, and shoot it, good. Okay, so I talked about if you're a shooter, shoot it. If you're a penetrator, penetrate. If you're a screener, go and set screens. So it was mentioned earlier that uh, I coached Andrew Bogan and uh, he obviously played with Golden State Warriors. His job was to screen for Steph Curry and Clay Thompson. That was his job. He ain't, he's not going to shoot the ball out here. He's not doing that. But he's going to go and headhunt and get this player open. Because if you get Steph Curry or, or play Thompson open, it's going down. You've got to understand that. Know what your role is. And he gets his points by then rebounding. Okay, so we screen down, you come off and you shoot it, you get on the glass. Here we go. Kick. Come off. Kick it on, kick it on. So screen, screen, screen. Come off. 
get on the bars. Okay, so right now, that's how you get your points. That's how you're gonna get your points. Get on the glass, rebound. Okay, here we go. So we're in three sides, three down, or pin down. Good, here we go. As you're coming off, okay, we know, like I might pull this, like I might be in a timeout, a huddle, and I say we're in three side pin down. So as you're coming off this here, you're, you're sort of getting to this spot, so I'm waiting for that action. Okay, so now, off this action, instead of coming up to the shot, you're going to curl as hard as you can to the basket. So it's curl, pin down, to curl cut. Here we go. Kick. Come off. Curl it hard. Okay. So, if this person isn't a shooter, they don't come up to shoot it. If you're a slasher, get on the rib. Right, so I come off. I'm coming off hard here because look at all the space here because you guys have been really unselfish, you've spaced it, you've lifted, so this whole key is open. If for some reason they clogged the key, they've clogged the key there because they've all jumped in, they've all jumped in right now, make the pass, you're a shooter, shoot it. Because your defense is clogging the key. You've clogged the key, kick it on, find the extra player. So if they want to pack it in when you're curling hard, that's okay. These plays are going to be open over here, so that's why you've got a little radar, you see what's going on. Let's go back to pin down and curl. Pin down and curl. Here we go. Kick. Come off. So we're going to curl it now, we're going to curl it hard. Pin down, curl hard, curl. Get on the rim. Nice. Here we go, next group. Good. Here we go, next one. Kick it on, move it. Kick it on, kick. Pin down, curl it hard. Nice. Okay, next one. So that's a curl for a person in the corner who's a non-shooter. Get on the rim. So the person curling, you're going to post up. The big that screens, you're going to pop. So we're going to throw up to the big and then we're going to go inside. So this is curl and pop. Curl and pop. Three side, curl and pop. Go. Kick it on, kick. Space it. Kick it on, come off. Pin down. Curl it. No, no, hold it right there. Full set. So we're going to hit this person. So offset the screen, you curl. I'm popping back. They throw it to me. If I'm a three point shooter, shoot it. But right now, isolate right there, okay? If I can't make that pass, because it's fronted, I skip it, high low. Yep, pass it in, and we play out of that. If we can't make the pass, it's your turn to play, okay? So we're gonna curl this hard, hit the guy popping. So this is curl and pop, and go. So kick, move it on, come off. Come off. Good. Make a move. Nice. Right, here we go. Come off. Come off. Space it. Open the key up. Come off. Curl it hard. And so right now, this person here, what you don't want to do is actually come in the key just now because it's taking away this cutting angle. So we've got to be patient. So I'm coming off, I'm a passer. So I'm coming off, there, you've curled it in, I'm looking. Okay, so I throw it there, stay out of the way. Don't go in the key. If you go in the key, the defense goes in the key. Okay, so if I come all the way in, it's hard for me to make the pass. Okay, so this is where we've got to have the discipline of spacing. 
and it's one of the hardest things we can do. So that's what we call curl and pop, reset. It's when I blow the whistle, stop. Okay, go. Kick it on, kick, hot potato. Kick it on, kick it on, and stop right there. So, with the screen enrolled, there's lots of different ways you can defend this. So right now, you, let's get defense on here. Okay, so you set your man up. Okay, so we go nice and slow. Okay, just don't worry about the drill, come and set the screen. And what happens all the time, this person goes hard show, okay? I'm coming out to here, okay? So that's a hard show on the on-ball screen. So it's a scout. We know that that's how they're gonna defend this. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to slip the screen. Slip the screen. So let's bring the ball back here. Don't worry about the defense now. Okay, so who, who's up here? Who's in the corner? In the corner? Yep, okay, so it's three side. Slip. So you make the pass, fake the screen, come over, V cut, get on the rim, go. So, no, no, don't, don't, don't do ballet. Okay? So come here, I step, I'm going here, and you're going to make the pass. There's no defense because you've left it. If there is defense there, that's our pass. So you've got to get our eyes up. So this is slip. So as soon as you catch it, you're going to come over as if you're setting the screen. Stop, I'm going to the basket. Make the pass. And go. Slip. Good. And we make the layer. So we're in three side slip. And go. Next through. Three side slip. Kick it on. No, 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 no. Reset. Make sure cut the drill. Kick it on. Kick. Come off. Face it, face it, face it. Lift. Slip. Good. Good. Here we go. Next group. Kick. Lift. Kick it on. Kick. Slip. Okay. Now this time, instead of you making the pass, fire it to the corner. So when I catch it, so take it back. So as soon as I get it, I'm going to fire it straight to the corner and get on the ring. So it's just changed the angle of the pass. Okay. So I can pass it here or I can pass it there. So let's hit the corner and have a look at that. Right, here we go. So three side slip. Three side slip. Kick it on. Come off. Move it. Move it. Slip. Good. Okay. So, yep, next group. Three side slip. Throw it to the corner. Kick it on. Kick, 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 slip. Good, good. Go. Next one. Next one. Go. Three side slip, high low. Three side slip, high low. Okay, what was the instruction? It, it was on the fly, okay? So, high low. So, right now, I've, I've covered this pass. Throw it there. Post up, throw it in. Layer. So, three side slip, high low. So now we're adding in an extra pass. And go. Kick. Kick it on. Kick. Kick, slip, slip, high low. Good. Okay, this time you don't need to dribble over here because we're throwing it to the corner. And last one. Go. Last one. Hot potato. Quick, guys. Quick, quick, quick. Kick it on. Kick it on. Kick it on. Kick it on. Throw it in, kick, excellent, nice job. Okay, so how many times, how many times did we dribble the basketball? Once, once when the ball came off there. One dribble and we kicked it and there were six passes then and you get a layer. So what I've done, I've done a lot of research and with my team in particular, that if we, if we only pass the ball one to two times in an offence, our shooting percentage was approximately 25, 30%. So one to two times, 25, 30% is the scoring efficiency. When we pass the ball five times in an offence, 
we scored 70% of the time. 70%. So let's reset. So what we do is by having good passing and ball movements that you're going to get high percentage shots. So we're going to go exactly uh, two side, three side, slip high low. As fast as we can. Ready? And go. Let's count the passes. Here we go. Kick. One, two, three, four, five, six. We get on the rim. So six passes, that's a really high percentage pass. The last three side action I want to show right now, okay, when the ball comes back, just stop. Go, go. We've only got a few minutes to go here, boys. Kick, kick, and stop. What teams now do is deny this pass. They deny it. The ball's there. On a denial, automatic back cut. Go, and we're looking at the back door pass. So as soon as you catch it, okay, so I'll take your spot. So I've caught the ball there. Okay, so it's out there. So I catch it. I'm looking, I'm looking at that pass right there in that gap. If I can't make the pass, I don't make the pass, you're going to go all the way through the corner. Go there. Now we're in a two-man game. We're in a two-man game. So right now, I go dribble handoff. So I catch it, it's there, I go dribble handoff, we're playing. So we're in game. I can dive it, I can pop, I can, you know, I might turn the corner and get a layup. You might make the pass to there. High low. Nothing's on. What are we in this side? Three man game. Okay, so it's reset. Three side. Back cut, dribble hand off. Back cut, dribble hand off. And go. Here we go. Kick. Kick. Come off. Back cut. Back cut. Dribble hand off. Go. You guys fight. Play, 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 play. There we go. Good. Next group. So. Three side, dribble hand off. Back cut, dribble hand off. Go. Kick, kick. Kick it on. Back cut, dribble hand off. Good. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Now what we're going to do is get real funky. We're going to get really, really tricky here. Is we're going to go back cut this side as well. All right, so we go three side back cut. Malay yung number 17. Catch it. Back cut, dribble hand off. There you go. We're going to get real, real funky now. And go. Kick. So three side. Kick. Back cut. Back cut. Come off. Back cut. Back cut. Dribble hand off. Lift. Good. Yeah, so on the back cut, you go through all the way to the corner. Okay. So I actually run that. Just say we're up by four points, late clock. We want to use the whole 24 second clock. If we've got it, I'll tell our players to run double back cut series because it takes time off the clock, but we know that we're going to get possibly a layer or we're going to get a dribble handoff. Okay, so right now, let's go double back cut again. You guys, same thing, so kick, kick it on, kick it on. Back cut, dribble handoff. Back cut, dribble hand off, come off, and we play out of that. Okay, so right now, we're going to get back to this side, but when you're going to, we're going to go high low. We're going to go high low. So we're going back cut, back cut, make the pass, we go going high low, and go. So now we're getting funky. We go kick, kick, come off, kick it on, back cut, dribble hand off, come off. Kick, back cut, lift, 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 lift. High low, high low, high low, high low. Yeah, high low. You guys just stuffed that up. Let's go again. Here we go. Same group. Okay, so. Good, so we have a lift on that. You go high low. And go. Last one. Last one. Let's get this right. Kick, come off. Kick it on. Back cut, dribble hand off. Back cut, back cut, dribble hand off. Highlight, 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 highlight. There we go, and game winner. Good job, boys. Here we go. All right. Okay, so as I said, 
first phase of offense, we're always trying to score. Always trying to get high percentage getting layups. Filipino players are some of the best in the world at fast break. That's the spread. Fantastic. The second thing, secondary offense is phase two. So you don't have a fast break, now we're moving the ball. Okay, moving the ball, we might throw it to the post, in the staggers or whatever it might be. It's a San Antonio transition. If it's a dead ball, this is what we're going to run. So we go four out, one in. Four out, one in. As soon as you catch it, it's one on one. One on one. Then it's two man game. You, you guys, it's your turn to play. Do whatever you want to do. You can drive it past baseline, you can throw behind, you can play it. It's two man game. If you can't score, get the ball the other side, three man game. So there's lots of things you can do out of the three man game. So I just showed you a whole lot of stuff there. There's extra stuff you can do there. But right now, don't try and do all of it. Just keep maybe one thing out of it. It could be throwback, it could be high low. It could be, from then we've got post cutting rules and things like that which I haven't touched on. But the, the thing is, it, it, it's a team game. Uh, it's about moving the ball. And I showed you guys that there was only one dribble or two dribbles and there's five or six passes. You're going to have high efficiency. So in the half court, the more times you pass the basketball, the higher the percentage. If you're just going to dribble, head down, bum up and do all of those things, now you're going to be in a lot more trouble because as you get to a higher level, it's actually easier to defend the dribble than it is to defend the pass. Okay, so if you can take something away from this, when you're building up your half-court offense, play to your strength. Do what you're good at doing. If you're a shooter, shoot it. If you're a penetrator, penetrate it in the appropriate spot. Okay, if you're a screener, go on the screen and get on the rim. Okay, do all those things that you do well. But individual skill development, your footwork, how to break a player down, step back moves, go you know, posting up in the post, our rip through, Euro step, one bounce jump shot, three point shooting. Don't try and do everything at once, look to build that up. Okay, so time up, it's been a really long day. Uh, I hope you guys uh, got some, some things out of that. It's always, you know, love, love working with you guys. Tomorrow I'm actually going to I'm going to do some, I'm going to build up our uh, a, a zone defense. What well, I say the proper way of teaching the zone. It's not a stand in the pee. It's a, a man to man in the zone, and then how you beat it, how you beat it. So big big clap to these guys as well. Great job.